Hi, this is Wendy from French and Lovely. I'm about to make a mindfulness journal, so I thought I would show you what I'm making it from. Um, this is a fantastic old French book from, I think it's 1896. There you go. Absolutely gorgeous, but sadly falling to pieces. All the pages are falling out, quite a few are missing. So I'm going to give it a new life. So that's going to be my base. I've been dyeing papers all morning, which is why I have purple fingers, by the way. Um, there's some lovely red wine stained papers and some coffee ones as well. There we go. And I've been rubber stamping some of them as well, which is quite fun. I've also done some inspirational quotes and sayings and some coping techniques, which I think are very important. And this is a one of my favourite places. This is a, a photograph that I took and it's on the way to my friend Sarah's house. So my, one of my happy places. I also have some wonderful old French uh, invoices and accounts papers which are genuine wonderful antiques and vintage items this big credit one comes from this amazing book from August 1965 which again it's a shame to cut up an old book but somebody had already done it they'd taken out the first few pages and here you can see it's falling a little to pieces but some lovely old French writing in there. I also have some lovely exercise books which are beautifully written in. Oops, upside down. And these I've bought at French antiques markets. They're never going to be looked at again. They're absolutely gorgeous. So let's give them a second life and let other people enjoy them. There's quite a few of those that I'm going to be using. And also some sheet music here, some bits of old newspaper. Just so much wonderful, genuine vintage items. Again, I've got some lovely old L magazines from the 1950s amazing fashions just gorgeous pictures they're already in pieces so let's chop them up a bit more and use them again also one of my favorite things is these books you find them in quite a lot of french antiques markets i've got some lovely ones that are antiques and in really good condition that i'm going to keep but this is one that's definitely seen better days. Um, dates from 1913. So genuine antique, fabulous images that I can use in my journals. Along with a few modern bits, I love these napkins and they just have such a lovely effect. So we're having some of these along with, again, some genuine, beautiful vintage mini postcards a souvenir from Paris, which will go in. Finally, fabrics. Just wonderful, wonderful vintage French fabrics. I've got a whole box in, I don't know if the box in. Just amazing. I just love it. I've been collecting these for years, so it's good that I'm actually going to be using them. Like these beautiful, fantastic napkins. But sadly, they've got rusty at some point. They've been left out, got damp or whatever. So let's give them a new life. So that's it. I'll be back to you when I've done some work on my journal. Here's the before photo.